and video rolling. And here we go. Here we go. We have arrived at Kulchuk Lake. Look at that beautiful color. Glacial Lake. And this is our goal. Dragon Tail. Kulchuk Peak off there. See if I can get a nice shot of it. There. Kulchuk Pass Asgard right there. Pass. But we're going up Asgard. That will be tomorrow's job. Today, up that sucker. And then behind the peak and up there. Now that is an impressive mountain. Look at that wall. Oh, God. <laughs> the Cascades. Yes. Oh, man, this is we exciting. We're going to bring crampons tomorrow, that's for sure, if we're going to go up there. We have crampons. I know it, but I didn't bring them today. Good, so. but we are getting, but glacier. It's all exposed in the middle. Okay, no, no massive shruns, which is good. All right, now we just got to get over there. Now we got to get over there. But you know what? Let's do a binocular check to scout our route up Asgard. Oh, we have been on the trail around the lake for a little while now. And we're on the other side. And up there, Kulchuk Pass. And that, Dragon Tail. Man, what a face! Woo -hoo! And the sun's kind of in the way, so we can't see Asgard Pass. But, dear gosh, that. Ooh, I heard a mosquito. I don't care at this point. <laughs> There's the lake. That's down Asgard Pass. Say hi to the camera. Hello, you unit. I'm looking up at Dragon Tail here. That is a spire for the ages. And there is up Asgard Pass. What a face. Look at the snow gullies in there. Yeah. And we have reached the top of Asgard Pass. Look at those peaks in the distance. The Northern Cascades. That's a horseback. What peak was this one over here? That's the uh, part of the enchantments. You mean right over there? Yes. Okay, Annapurna's over there. That broad flat thing. Not over that, the spired one. The spires are something else. Yeah. Little Annapurna. Above the lake. Yep. And our destination. Oh dear. We'll see if we can actually do this. That is quite intense. Check in the book right now to see if we can find a way. Dragon's Tail. Dragon Tail Peaks. Dragon Tail Peak. And we are now uh, on our way up the snow slopes. High on Dragon's Tail. Or Dragon Tail. Ah, I always get it mixed up. <sighs> what? The summit is up there somewhere. And we have had to improvise because one of us forgot our uh, sunglasses, which is problematic on a day like today with all this snow at this elevation. By the way, this marks the highest climb I have ever done. I've never gone higher than 6,288 feet. I think, are we over 8,000 at this point? We might be, we're approaching 8,000 feet at this point. Out there are the enchantments. Well, let's get to it. The hour grows late. Sauron's forces are already gathering. Anyways, bye. Well, it was hairy going up that snow slope. We weren't sure if we were going to have to turn around. But we're at the top of the snow slope at least. And look out there. Oh. Now that's a mountain. Hi, Rainier. I'll climb you one day, I swear it. Amazing, Adams. Coal truck is over there, down there somewhere. And there is our final goal, over 8,700 feet, Dragon Tail. Man, you were an intense mountain. All right, folks, bye-bye. Trials and tribulations, and we have made it. Dragon Tail Summit. Man, this place gives you the heebie-jeebies. There's Stuart over there, over 9,000 feet. 
There's some great shots right there. Forgive the uh, jiggy jiggeriness of the camera. I'm kind of precariously positioned right now, as you can tell. Come down here, my goodness, so you won't be so jiggery. I need to get a shot of that. By the way, that's like straight down. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> oh my. How do these people do it? You mean uh, rock climbers? Yeah, Nerves of steel. All righty. See you, folks. It's been a great day. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. We have made our descent, at least to the call, from the summit. And we have Rainier over there and a fly. And Rainier's over there is in nice and cloudy. Choo! Sorry about that, folks. And I really wanted to spend this time to get a nice shot of the snow fields. These were the, uh, probably the most precarious part of our climb. And despite the heat, whew, there's a lot of snow there. You can see the path that we took, a path that many people have taken. That was the easy part. Getting to that was a lot yeah, more difficult. And now we're about to try the descent of the snow fields. We'll get on right about there. Uh, this will probably be the freakiest part of the whole climb. I gotta say, standing on the summit with those precarious cliffs was pretty freaky. This will probably be more so, because we're gonna have to slide down using ice axes. Oh yeah, good times. Oh yeah, all right. And we are in mid-descent of the snow fields. However, it turns out we don't have to descend the snow fields, at least so far. There's been a nice path down these side boulders. If only we knew that coming up, it wouldn't have been so problematic. And summit's up there. It's been about 45 minutes since we left it. Yeah. And heading way down there. Long descent ahead. Hopefully our luck for the boulder field continues. Farewell. But we're headed down. Down there. Oh, you, well, you were, I was expecting you to fall right there. Yep, I'm zooming in. We have goats. Meh. <laughs> What a day! We have successfully navigated down the boulder field and avoided all of the snow fields. Well, most of them. There were some involved. Wow! I there were comes there were points when we were up there, looking this way, uh, we weren't sure if we were gonna make it, but we did. Air five to all the viewers. Guiana piggy. Fine. Don't answer me. That's okay. And here we are. You may not be able to hear me over the wind, so I'm just going to give you a panorama. It's not that much wind here. No, but nonetheless, it still may make for loud noises. We have completed the descent. In the shape. You're cramping my style. Oh. We have completed the descent of Asgard Pass. Whew, the toughest part is behind us. Yeah, there's the guy who just interrupted me. Oh, no! And there's the pass. I'm rubbing my sword. Yeah, I'm about to do that myself. Up there somewhere is the summit which we actually can probably see because it's so darn steep. Yeah, we could see down here. Yep. Probably one of those knobs up there. And in two days time, we'll head up there. Coltruck Pass. We'll see how the glacier walking goes. 
Oh, there's the sun. And the beautiful waters. We have returned to, well, that lovely little view spot by the lake. Oh, and, legs. yeah, our legs and feet are kind of achy after the descent down that. So, the water's pretty nice and crisp. It's not Mountain Brook cold, though, that's for sure, thank God. Otherwise, you wouldn't, wouldn't be able to stay. You wouldn't be in there for more than two seconds. <laughs> so we have Kulchuk and Dragon Tail. And that. You point out the summit there, Mark. I'm doing that as we speak. Oh, okay. The exact summit now? Right there. And I'm we zooming up. back. We were up there. 8,700 feet. Down this thing. Whew! What a day! All right. Farewell, folks.